Is Nitro Pepsi the next great thing in the cola evolution or just another gimmick? Keep watching to find out what I think. Welcome to another edition of Eric's Project Reviews. I am Eric and today I'm reviewing something a little bit different. Uh, this is the new Nitro Pepsi Draft Cola. Now I do consider myself to be a bit of a soda connoisseur. Uh, I love soda the way some people love wine. I love tasting soda. I like different sodas and I have very strong opinions about various sodas. If you want to know what my favorite is, you can ask me below. Today we're talking about Nitro Pepsi. This is the new nitrogen infused uh, cola from Pepsi. They have uh, both uh, regular flavor and then vanilla Pepsi. Uh, but the question is, you know, what is it? Why is it? Do we need this? Is it really something that's that's good and, and enhances the cola experience or is it just a gimmick? So uh, before I give you my opinion on it, we're going to jump over to video so you can see what it's like when you open the can and when you pour it and what it looks like when the nitrogen bubbles and all that good stuff. So let's check that out. Okay, so I've got my Nitro Pepsi here in my glass to pour it in. According to the instructions, you open, you hard pour it into the glass, and then you enjoy. So when I open it, you're going to hear the sound of it opening. It's scary. You think that it's going to, it sounds like the what a regular soda sound makes before it explodes and spews everywhere. But it's not going to. It's just the nitrogen being released into the soda and then I will pour it and you will see the way it creates the foam at the top. So here we go. There you go. And then pour hard. And at first it looks like regular soda because it looks like the bubbles are all throughout it. And just kind of like a regular soda, when you pour regular soda, the carbonation always forms bubbles at the top. The difference is this part at the top, it's this foamy part, that's basically all the bubbles. None of the carbonation, if you will, none of the nitrogen is stays in here. It pretty much all ends up on the top. So you get this nice top foamy part, which is really cool, um, but this part ends up basically not having any carbonation at all. So anyway, this is what it looks like. That's what it sounds like. And uh, let's get back to my review. So you can see, you open it up, you pour it in, you pour it hard, and then the, the nitrogen bubbles all come to the top and it produces this foamy part of the top. Uh, here's my simple take on this whole thing. The part of the top, the foamy part, that's really good. Uh, it's very similar to when you do a Coke float or a Pepsi float, if you will. And the soda, the carbonated soda mixes with the ice cream and you get that foamy part of the top. That part's good. But once you get past that, you're basically drinking flat soda. Yeah, that's what seems to happen to me. And I've had several of these several different times. And uh, yeah, it's like the, the nitrogen doesn't stay infused in the soda. This is why, I don't know exactly how it works on the inside, but I think that's why when you open it, you hear the sound of the, somehow they've made it so that when you open it, that's when the nitrogen is released. Because nitrogen just doesn't, I think, stay in soda the way regular carbonation does. And to me, when you drink soda, uh, half of it is the flavor of the soda. The, the mix of the flavor, but the other half of it is the carbonation. It's those those bubbles, that effervescent feeling while you're drinking it. That's part of what makes soda soda. With these this draft cola, this nitro Pepsi, you don't get that really. Uh, when you're drinking that top foam part uh, that the nitrogen uh, creates, that's good. That's that's interesting. That's like a uh, it's it's bubbly, but it's a it's a smoother bubbles again very much like if you mix vanilla ice cream into a cola and You get that foamy part of the top which does still have some carbonation, but also is much creamier That's kind of like what the foam part is on this, but once you get past that and then you just have the soda There's not really any anything in it. There's it's not like there's any effervescence or any carbonation or any anything. It really is like drinking a flat soda. It is the equivalent of opening a regular Pepsi 
and putting in your refrigerator for three days and then drinking it. Because the flavor's still there, why doesn't it taste good anymore? Well, because you expect it to be carbonated. So, I think that it's overhyped, honestly. Um, I'm a little bit disappointed. I was hoping it'd be something really cool, but it just isn't worth it because really only that top little layer of uh, the nitrogen bubbles at the top, the foam, that's, that part's good. Once you get past that, you're basically drinking flat soda. Uh, I think everyone should try it once. Just try it for yourself. Um, probably this is going to be one of those things that it's going to be popular at first because everyone is going to want to try it. And then it's going to fade into oblivion because everyone's going to realize I'm paying extra money to drink flat soda. And who, who wants to do that? Flat soda is not any good. Um, but that's my opinion. That's what it's like to me. Uh, the flavor is fine. It just tastes like regular Pepsi or vanilla flavored Pepsi. Uh, but it's just once you get past those nitrogen uh, foam part, it's just flat. And I don't know. Maybe there are some people out there who kind of like some pretty fl semi-flat sodas. They'll probably love this. That's probably like 1% of the population. But I think most of you are not going to like it. That's my opinion. That's what I think about it. Uh, you try it out for yourself. Comment down below, what do you think about it? Do you like it? Do you like flat soda? Do you not like flat soda, but you have a different opinion of it than I do? Let me know. We'll discuss it down in the comments below. Anyway, uh, yeah, that's going to be it for this review. Uh, don't forget to click that like button, subscribe to my channel, uh, so you can keep up with future product views, which mostly I review gadgets and electronics and household products and things like that. This is just something I did for fun because I do love soda and I thought this was a very interesting concept. I mean, kudos to Pepsi for trying because it is something very new. And I think that's great when companies try new and uh, innovative stuff. So anyway, um, that's going to be it until next time. So be safe and be happy.